Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome again to my channel. Thank you so much for dropping by, and today I'm gonna cook some sweet and sour spicy mud crabs, as you can see, courtesy of Costco. Yes. All right, look at that. These are heavy babies. All right. So, uh, the best, the best uh, crab you can get should be fresh. However, these are from Costco, so they are frozen. So you have to thaw them before you cook them, all right? So uh, for this one, I only have one female. The only, the, the thing to, uh, to tell you that it's a female or a male is this one. The female has a wider uh, bottom pouch and the male has a narrower one. And the reason for this is it's where they uh, put the roe, okay? Now it's very easy. This has already been towed, so just break it. You don't need this anymore. There we go. And then just open like this, okay? You can see, you can see that. So keep them. See that? You keep them. Because you're gonna, that's the best part there, all right? That's the best part, okay? So you, so you, look at this. Just scrape those off. Because you don't want to lose them, okay? That's the best part there. <laughs> that is the best part. That's the best part there. Okay. 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 Oh. Just do it like that, and take the, um, these are the, um, the gills of the mud crabs, okay? Reason why we take this one is because they will absorb the, um, the sauce, and we don't want that. All right, I've also preheated the oil there, so like that, it's all done. Perfect. Same as the other ones. Very easy, just slide it off with your thumb. Break it off over there. Open the shell. You see the difference from the um, female and the male? See the difference here? Female is really, really juicy and fatty. So. I will explain to you later what this mixture is. So this is the sweet and sour sauce. So what's in here is the one pack of Mamacita sweet and sour sauce, uh, some corn flour, uh, one and a half tablespoon corn flour, four tablespoon of Dr. Pote uh, sugar cane. This is sugar cane vinegar, is that right? Sugar cane vinegar, Madeira sugar, and it's all in there, okay? That's it. Look at the row there in the fat. Yeah, just make sure you get those, because those are the best part. All right. Okay. All right. Take the gill out again. Okay. So we were gonna, after I clean this one, we will gonna quickly stir fry them, okay? Quick! Oh, there we go. Look at the close. Okay. You see, the males are not so fatty. That's why, if you can only choose, if you go to the fish market and get those live crabs, you know, always get the female ones, all right? So you see, male, not much fat in row there. Let's just give it a little crack. That's it. All right. Not bad for a guy. 
all good. Very, very little. Get the gills to the incinerator. Okay. Incinerator, that's it. That's how you do it. Alright. And one more guy. One more gentleman. Sorry, Sebastian. But today, you are lunch. All right. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Get the kills. Kills. Kills away. Okay. Yeah. All right. Oops. Back there, boy. All right. Yep. Everything on the accelerator. All right. <laughs> That's it. So ha that's how you clean them and before I stir fry them ladies and gentlemen so I'm just gonna give all the the pincher some crack uh, with my ballet so again the sweet and sour mixture is mamacita sweet and sour powder uh, cornstarch four tablespoon of um, sugarcane vinegar Madeira sugar so that's for the sauce later all right and uh, Together with the sauce will be some red capsicum, spring onions, uh, uh, julienne, and finely chopped, and uh, also cubed uh, onions. And then to um, stir fry this one, you use ginger. And for later on, I will put the um, star anise and bay leaves just for aromatic purposes. All right. And together with the sauce as well, we will add the... Uh, Sweet and sour, sweet, sweet and sour chili sauce, oyster sauce, a little bit of olive oil, and this one here, some spicy, spicy chili um, sauce, and some spicy bean sauce as well. So when I return, ladies and gentlemen, okay, I will show you the um, cooking process for the sauce. So I'm just going to stir fry quickly these mud crabs and I'll return with that sauce uh, preparation. Catch you later. And part two of the sweet and sour spicy mud crab. So this is the sauce uh, process, okay? So first, a little olive oil. That's it. Okay. Make sure it's burning. It's burning. All right. Now, drop the ginger. Crushed garlic, not too much. All right, excellent. And now, now, just drop everything: the cube onions, the slice, small slice spring onions, the julienne spring onions, and the capsicum, all right? That's it. Let's drop it. Don't be shy. Slow stir.
so the heat setting on your cooktop will be uh, between low to medium, all right? While you're sauteing the um, the veggie, okay? Oh, I wish you could smell it, folks. That's it. And now, as you can see over here, this pan over here, the um, the mud crab is perfectly stir fried over here. So this one, okay? You see that? <laughs> Perfection. And yeah. And then now, the sauce mixture, the mamacita, sweet and sour, corn flour, uh, sugar cane vinegar, and Madeira salt over here, and the roll of the mud crab. Now from this point onwards, you have to put the heating into high, okay? Don't be shy, high. Give it a quick stir. Show you. I'll show you folks. This will be very fast. Nothing left there. Alright. Now stir gently. And you see it slowly. Slowly. Okay? Yep. Now add the sweet and sour, just two tablespoons of the sweet and sour chili ketchup, oyster sauce, two tablespoons, one, two tablespoons, mm -hmm. delicious. The hot sauce. Just one tablespoon. And then the spicy bean. One tablespoon. That's it. That's it, folks. Boom, boom, chakra. Okay. Just look at this. Look at this. Drop the star anise. Bay leaves. Oops. Yep. All right. See? Okay. Remember, this is high heat. Now I'm gonna drop the beautiful crabs. Just drop those baby in. Just drop them. them. That's it. That's it. Oh. Oops. Oops. Once you drop the baby, put it back to low. Okay? Alright. Sauce. Give it a quick roundabout. Over there. Oh my. I wish you could smell this, folks. I really do. I really do. I swear to God. I wish you could smell this. Now it's a beautiful weather outside. When I come back, I will show you the finished product serve we're gonna dine out today outside at the deck beautiful weather okay stay tuned for that catch you later in just a few minutes i'm back again folks and this is for the final result ready to serve sweet and sour spicy mud crab okay come follow me join me let's go out to the deck beautiful weather and there's only one way to eat these mud crabs, folks. These mud crabs mm, smell so divine. Look at this. Oh, follow me, follow me. All right, all right, over there. All right. <laughs> all right. So you have to prepare this one here. That's for the rubbish. Okay. And look at the head. That's it, folks. All right. Beautiful weather. Look at that, Sunny. 
I think we should open this one. That's it. And that's it, folks. I'll just show you. Where's that lady? I think this is the. I think this is the girl. Yeah, I'll take the. I think the girl crab, the lady crab. Okay, because I'm a monster, I'll have two. Okay, that's it. Okay, I, I really wish you could smell this, folks. Look at those pinchers. I'll put them there. All right. I'll put them there. All right. And that's it. I'll just show you later. That one you can just scoop it with your finger. But look at this. Look at this. Huh? Mmm. Oh, perfect. Cook to perfection. There's no other way to eat it but this with your bare hands, folks. Look at this. Hmm? Hmm? Come closer. Taste it. Look at that. And that's it, folks. Mm. So good. Thank you again for dropping by my channel. I have to finish and devour this delicious mud crabs from Costco. Now, like I've said in the beginning, it would be best to have a, the fresh one, but it's very hard to get here in New Zealand. So thank you so much. Please click like and subscribe and share if you um, enjoyed this video. Until next time, take care. Have a lovely weekend, everybody.